Now, this is Brady Armstrong. He's 12 years old, a sixth grader at Fall Creek Intermediate. Earlier this year, he was diagnosed with Hodgkin lymphoma and is currently in the fight of his life. But now the community, plus some strong men from the WWE world, are coming together to show their support. Anthony and Kevin are here with us this morning. And you might know Kevin as Kevin Thorne from, the Kevin Thorne. <laughs> Thorne from his professional wrestling days. Guys, thank you for being here with us this morning. And what is your connection exactly to Brady. Thank you. So um, our sons played football together on a team called the Knights. It's a travel football team in uh, the town of Fishers. Um, so a few of the dads had gotten together and really socially had become good friends and um, had a, just a strong desire to try to give back. So that's how that's how this kind of came about. So Brady so, is you know, basically yeah. we found out Brady. Sons. Yeah, Brady. Brady ended up. Um, mm -hmm. uh, he had a, a, a tw what they thought was a torn groin, is what they said. Um, you know, lo and behold, going going further into it, what what was really happening was he uh, he had lymphoma, is what they mm -hmm. found out. Um, and so his mom ended up calling me one day uh, and was like, "Hey, just come over and make Brady laugh." And I was like, "Okay." So I came over and uh, it was just like, um, you know, it, it called them and it was like, "What what can we do? Like, what what can we do?" And uh, and that's where we kind of came up with the wrestling event. So yeah, go into the wrestling event. So. When is it? What time? And what will people find there? So, it, uh, you know, WWE style wrestling event. Um, you know, a lot of former stars from WWE. We got uh, you know uh, Billy Gunn, who just went in the Hall of Fame uh, as as DX this year. Um, Al Snow, uh, Bob Hardcore Bob Holly, uh, Cowboy James Storm from TNA, uh, and then my old uh, tag team partner uh, Marcus Corvan, who was in WrestleMania 23 with me. Um, I made the call to him, and he was like, man, i, I got to come down and help. So all these guys are coming in to help us out, and then basically what we have is we have OVW Wrestling, which is based out of uh, Louisville, Kentucky, where, you know, names like Cena, Batista, and all that came through there. Now, you know, they're coming up. They're going to put up the ring in Finch Creek, and, I mean, we're going to have a we're going to have a heck of a time. So really at 7 o'clock, uh, the ring will go into the middle of Finch Creek. There will be an upstairs mezzanine with uh, adult beverages. So uh, the adults can hang out up there while the kids and more of a family atmosphere will be around the ring. Um, so, yeah. And it's so, the 4th? The 4th. Fourth. Fourth of May. May the 4th. Fourth. So May the 4th be with you. It's kind of <laughs> like a Star Wars theme. So you know what? If you want to dress up Star Wars, we encourage it. Bring lightsabers, we encourage it. I mean, you know, um, it's, it's, it's a community event. And we, what we want to do is, I mean, we want to raise as much money for Brady's family as we can. Yeah, so talk about that. How will the ticket sales go to benefiting Brady and his family? So the good news is that we've raised enough money to cover the complete cost to put on the event. Mm -hmm. So every dollar that goes toward ticket sales and uh, beverages go toward his medical bills. So um, there's nothing being kept back. It's all going toward him. And just the connection that you had with your, uh, this is one of your son's friends, his teammates, but right. just how it has touched both of your hearts. I'll speak to that. So, um, you know, as a father, I've, I've got two sons. Um, so I, I think something happens when you become a parent, right, and you really empathize with what the family's going through, especially with a, someone this young. Um, when the, the child doesn't really understand what's going on, that's one thing. He's 12 years old, so he's fighting this and is fully aware of what's going on. So um, our heart just goes out to the family, and we want to try to do whatever we can. Yeah, uh, yeah. You said it best. Yeah. I mean, yeah. We're, just, we're fortunate yeah. to have somebody with uh, uh, his reputation and, and uh, um, uh, connections to a major event like this with, with WWE. Mm -hmm. So we thought we'd capitalize on um, uh, his ability to get out there and wrestle and uh, try to just give back. It was just something fun, fun for the family. And, you know, Brady's a wrestling fan, stuff like that. You know, most kids, you know, his age are wrestling fans. So it's like, you know, what, what can we do? Um, you know, and I think that's, that's kind of where, you know, it was, it was a no-brainer. For us, for us to do, and I, you know, I called my, my guys up, and they're all like, "When is it? Like, we're, we're there." So, you know. So, okay, May fourth, one last time. Yep. May fourth time. Seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Uh, doors open at six. Okay. Seven o'clock bell time. Uh -huh. uh, be about a, a two and a half hour show. We'll still get you home and stuff like that. A, a little bit of something for everything, uh, you know, or everybody. Um, you know, uh, like I said, we are going to have beer sales, but it's going to be up away from the mezzanine. Mm -hmm. uh, on a mezzanine, you know, kids will all be on the floor, uh, stuff like that. Uh, Finch Creek is an amazing field house, brand new in Noblesville, uh, super cool uh, turf, uh, basketball courts, everything. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, it's definitely worth coming to check out that, too. You so, sold it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, and I, and I think yeah. the other important thing here is even if you're not a wrestling fan, 
it's the sense of community that we're trying to provide, right? Have the whole town and everybody in the state here, or if they want to, yeah. come together and try yeah. to help out this, yep. this uh, young man. Yeah. Guys, Let's thank you Brady. so much. Do it for Brady. Help him destroy cancer. Thank awesome. you guys so much. And we'll have all the information you need to know posted on our website, WTHR.com.